Hello everyone, this is Zachary Dreyer, and hey, I'm actually back in Cataclysm with the uh, Experimental Build 2517. Yes siree. Uh, technically, we still had a character in the uh, stable version, but it's been so long I can't even remember him, so we're just going to get right into the game. Oh, actually, uh, yes, I just remembered something. I was going to uh, make a note. I changed some things in here, but I found this interesting. Apparently, death cam is a thing. So, maybe we'll die and find out what that is. Who knows? Uh, I'm not going to touch much here. Thing seems about right. Uh, you never know. Anyway, uh, anything? Oh, nope, that went that way. Interesting. And, uh, Croset? Yeah, that's a decent name, sure. Well, let's go with that for the world. Not character world. Ah, uh, yes. Such a thing. Um. Hmm. That is a thought. I'm going to do something. Uh. Oh, and I turned, uh. What's it? The, uh. Rust off. I'll have to actually try that at some point. So, either here or there. Night vision. Self aware? Do I want self aware? Hmm. No. Self aware. We'll go with what we got instead. Perception up to there. HP up to there. And that's all I'm going to do. I'm going to, uh. Oh, wrong key. There we go. Nathan can. Yes. And, uh, okay, apparently... Oh, nope. To graphics. Just to note, I use Retro Days as my default whenever I play this. I really should check out a few more of them, but this is good. Uh, emergency jacket and folded blanket. That'll be useful. Uh, yes, I'll take that. Uh, what am I wearing anyway? Uh, winter coat. Okay, I start with winter coat. That's probably good. Um, my torso's all right. My head is kind of, and my arms, yeah, I'll definitely uh, throw on that. Uh, how's my arms doing now? Arms are, well, the arms warmed up just fine. Okay, that's good then. And we'll take the folded emergency blanket. And apparently I didn't turn on NPCs, but that's all right, honestly. Uh, we can uh, play with NPCs later. For now, for now, we'll just stick with what we have. Plus, it'll make us more of a uh, survivor type of thing, rather than just someone else that happened to survive. Which doesn't make much sense, but it sounded better in my head. Small power substation. For here's a mine, right? Yeah, mine. Um, hmm. Oh, black rat, of course, you're hostile. Um, smash, 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 smash. Really? I don't seem to be damaging it, apparently. There's a rock over here. Okay, then I'm just gonna close this. We'll come around the other way. <sighs> this side. I went out the right way the first time, apparently. It's not telling me it. Dang it, I don't seem to be damaging the ding thing. Well, first thing I notice is they've made lockers harder. Um, oh, I'm not wielding the rock. That might help. There we go. That was, that, that worked a lot more effectively. I could make a rock and a sock, or as I prefer, I'm going to make the makeshift crowbar. And we'll drop that and wield that. Wield. There we go. 
Anything else in here interesting? There's some stuff that could be useful, but for now, I think we're good. I'm going to go check the mine, because it occasionally has some interesting stuff there. And what are you... We wear acid rain. Several caustic chemicals in the air react with rain clouds to cause deadly acid rain. No word yet on if this is a deliberate tactic or a side effect of the earlier bombing. Hint. Yes. The answer is yes. Um, I hope that cat doesn't come near me. Uh, zombie drug. Truth or fiction? Um, I'm going to go with truth here. Uh, I don't know why, but I, I feel it in my heart. Truth. What is that? Oh, jumper cable. That makes sense. Um, are they hostile? No, they're dogs. Okay. Then as long as you stay over there and kill each other, apparently... Not gonna question that. They wanna kill each other. Then power to them. Blackjack Oak. Okay, it looks like the uh, fall through for graphic packs might be working better. And uh, to check that, I'll just check a few of the other graphic sets. Um, nah, doesn't quite look like it. Maybe that's the, uh, who knows. Anyway, I'll, I'll check it out later. Let's see, how close are we? We're getting closer. Uh, what's the moose think of me? Apparently there's a lot of cats. Well... They can all just ignore me. I'm not going to do anything to them. Stay away. Undershirt. Lots of good stuff. I'll take the lighter. Um, and I'll take the undershirt. There we go. Actually, you know, I'll take the pair of scissors. That could be useful. Basketball shorts. Don't quite need that. Um. Yeah. Oh, and a lighter with one. Looks like it could potentially be a good place to sleep. Or maybe here. Leather backpack. I'll grab it. Panties. Okay. Purse. Purse compared to leather backpack. How's the volume? <laughs> they have the same volume. Okay, yeah, no contest. Just throw on the leather backpack. Uh, that'll make our torso encumbrance five, though. Hmm. Leather pants that fit. I'll definitely grab that. And we can drop the jeans. Or, uh, actually, what's our leg encumbrance? Two and two... How much is that affecting us? Dodge down. Hmm. I think we're good with this right now, so we'll keep that up. Sadly, I won't be able to, at this point, hack it. Probably want to find a book or something on it, but that gave me some starting supplies. More than I would have had before, so that's fine. I can't really ignore the black rat. Black rats are actually somewhat hostile from experience. Though they seem to not be anymore. Maybe they fixed that. Or maybe they just never were as hostile as I remember them. <sighs> that is always a possibility. Um, I think I'll go check out the mansion. Uh, oh, and one thing I could note, or one thing I will note, is that I did extend the starting vision range up to max. Normally it's 15 and I upped it to 20. Uh, that's just a personal preference of mine. Darn it, I forgot. I didn't grab the uh, scout perk. <clears throat> so I don't have extended uh, view range. Sad face. I like that perk. The invasion is GM troops. Yep. 
Actually, I'd call them zombies, and it's not really an invasion, but, you know, why, why try to say weird stuff? Just let it flow. I don't plan on dying. That's generally not how this ends up working, but I don't plan on dying. So that's a thing. No zombies seen me yet. Oh, never mind. What am I talking about? All the zombies saw me. If by all of them I mean four, five, yep, five, six, seven, eight, a number. That's what I might as well be saying at that point. Ah, oh, dang it. Huh, I might die to this. I just might die to this. Ah, dang it. I bit my left arm. Well, actually, I can see on the one screen that no, by bite, it doesn't literally mean bite. Hmm. Oh, this could, uh, this could be annoying. Oh, nope, they just, uh, they just bashed it down. How damaged are you? Dang it, I didn't even manage to kill it with that. I was hoping to at least take it out. How damaged are you? Not very. It's partly my torso encumbrance. I have a lot of it. And that, that basically means <laughs> no. Um, take off the winter coat. How's that go for torso encumbrance? Ah, that makes it a lot better. Yeah, I think I'll stick with that. There we go, yeah, that works a lot better. Might be able to make it through this now that I remember that I had a ridiculous... Okay, there we go. We managed to kill one. Actually, most of these zombies are on somewhat low health. One managed to bite me, though, so that's basically the uh, worst outcome. I guess technically not the worst. I could be dead. It's just the worst currently. So that seems to be the most damaged one. Not that that does me much good since I can't seem to uh, manage their movement all that well. I think I'm just going to have to stand my ground here. Not exactly the best plan, but it worked. Okay, now I saw a flashlight in there somewhere. Uh, ripped cargo pants, I'll grab those. Flashlight, yes. Um, sure. Winter coat's back on. The cargo pants are on. Drop the jeans. Anything else in here? Not that I can think of right now. Those are just heavy sticks. The corpses are over here. Smash count or smash color thing. Okay, that's good to know, I guess. Ooh, a leather belt. I'll definitely grab that. And the hammer. Uh, 
A long sleeve shirt doesn't seem long for this world, but that's okay. Uh, more ripped cargo pants. I will gladly take that. Now, where did I end up? I ended up over here. I'm pretty hurt, and my, uh, one limb is, uh, bitten. Oh, right, there we go. Bite, not limb, torso. Even worse. <sighs> hmm. Take a sip of water. Um... And here's a weird colored tree, so it's probably got fruit. Nope. Apricot. Ripens in summer. I guess that's fair. I doubt any of the stuff around. Blueberries ripen later. Yeah, that's pretty... Oh, hello. Okay, so you're not hostile. For some reason, I doubt that, but okay. I need something to... I need antibiotics, or not antibiotics, I need uh, something to clean the wound. That doesn't seem to exist in that place. Um, small plastic bottle of Italian seasoning, some biscuits. No, I'm full. A pot. I'll grab that, I guess. Cream soda. PB&J sandwich. Some bacon. And a couple zombies. Take off. Winter. Yes. Those are torso encumbrance. Only one. As long as the cougar doesn't aggro, I should be fine. How's our uh, torso temperature? Huh, it actually isn't that bad right now. Damage my eyes. That's kind of annoying. <sighs> Darn it. Um, I'm going to die. Sure. So that's what the uh, death cam is. That's cool. Ow. My head. Yep. We killed a number of zombies. That wasn't too bad. Um. Let's see. I actually feel a little excited about that. Let's uh let's go with the default stuff again. We're going to grab fast reader, the uh night vision, and this time I'll remember to grab scout. Self aware? Do I want self aware? Yeah, I'll take self aware. I'll only end up with ten strength. Sure, why not? And Craig Ferguson. Yes. Hmm. Different place in the world, that's clear. Slime pit. Fungal tower. I'm assuming it. Anthill. I like anthills. They're pretty decent. What are you over here? An arcade. That sounds interesting, but somewhat useless for my kind of situation. <sighs> so, so, you can't win them all. Of course, we've got the emergency clothes there, though we've got all this stuff set up pretty well. Um, Emergency jacket. How much storage? You only had two. Hmm. I thought I saw some... Uh, Rocks. No, that's sand. 
Pretty sure these are rocks over here. And I need one of those, because apparently that's what's required to bash open a locker. No more rending steel with my bare hands. So yeah, to be fair, that is kind of what happened <laughs> beforehand. You would basically just go and be like, Oh, hey, yeah, metal locker. Gonna take it apart with my bare hands. <laughs> You're not gonna happen anymore. But is neither here nor there for me. It is simply what it is. Popular mechanics, some thread. I will gladly grab those things. Uh, shorts, no. Heat pack, no. Screwdriver, sure. Don't really need a fire extinguisher. Leather apron. Does that go on? Goes on the torso and legs. Encumbrant too, though. A hammer, sure. T-shirt? Eh. Don't need a t-shirt. So we got some interesting things. Okay. Yes. Um, we're going to grab that emergency jacket and throw it on. We're going to grab that. Yeah, we're going to up this. Not taking that. Though for you, it'll take a lot less since I decided to pause the recording right then. Uh, Popular Mechanics, it still has recipes in it. A uh, farm repair kit. It actually sounds useful, but we're going to drop that there. Take a sip of water. Well, we can do, but you know. And this time we'll actually head towards town and hopefully have a bit more luck. And uh, we are in safe mode. Good. How's it looking? Okay, yeah, we should be able to head this way. Hopefully uh, not run into too much stuff. And actually... Switch that. Oop. What do we see? Ah, zombies. Yes. That would be a slightly important thing to take note of. Though I think actually the, uh, oop, went too far. Zoom function seems to work just as fine. So I'll probably stick to using that instead of switching between the, ah, uh, dang it, spore clouds. Really? Spore clouds? You have to be here. <sighs> hmm. Makes me kind of want to just avoid this area. Which is probably the best option. I just do not have what it takes to face that kind of opposition at the dang it, zombie soldier. Okay, it hasn't actually seen me. Which is probably the best thing I've had noted so far. Um, this place over here might be a good place to check up on. Especially since I've gotten this close and haven't seen zombies. Uh, China invades? Nope. Not the answer there. Rename crowbar to F. That's a glow stick. That's a light jacket that fits. I'm going to drop the... Emergency jacket, and instead wear this. Okay, now how's my clothing situation? Uh, the hands are cold, can't help that. But everything else is within uh, somewhat expected ranges, so it should be fine. Tuxedo, boxer shorts. High class people lived here, apparently. So high class, they have a swanky setup for their whole thing there. Take this uh, saline solution, if that works. I've heard that it can clear the uh, gunk that the spitters, or not spitters, the uh, 
exploding guys get in your eyes. Which, if it does, that would be useful. Uh, and we're hungry, so we're going to eat pb and j sandwich. Steak knife, yes. A uh, pair of aluminum tongs. That could be useful. Uh, we've got the pocket knife. What does that do for stuff? Uh, butchering 12 quality. Steak knife. Butchering 20. Yes. Um, I think I'll keep that then. Uh, we don't have enough room to grab the pot. And there's some whiskey, because why not? Uh, macaroni. Uncooked burrito. Feral hunter. Did it see us? It did not see us. Um, but honestly... Hmm. The biggest thing about here is that I could potentially use it to sleep. So I'm going to let that stay. As it is. To the north, a decayed zombie sees me. Is that the only zombie that sees me? Because if it is, I can deal with it. One shot. Okay, we can't do two shots. Good to know. Good to know. Um, Three torso encumbrance. What's that coming from? Ah, I have all these things. Uh, encumbrance to the winter jacket or winter coat. That that's the uh, that's the answer there. You ripped my jacket! How dare you! Um. Hmm. And there isn't really anything in there to work for me. It's annoying. Uh, what's this? Just a seat. Okay. I was hoping it would be something a little more useful, but... Turns out it wasn't. But I guess that happens all the time. First step of entering a house. Close all the windows. Okay, that's not a window. A uh, light jacket. Uh, how much warmth? 25. And how much warmth do I need on my torso? I actually have more than I technically need. Let's grab a light jacket that fits. Yes, put it on. I could actually uh, drop the ripped one and grab a another one. The only downside is the encumbrance, or not encumbrance, the, um, words. Uh, <sighs> volume. Volume is the word I seek. Did they notice me? One zombie noticed me. Never mind, multiple zombies notice me. Am I, oh, dang it. We've got the uh, one tower right behind us. Looks like I might need to invest in the uh, one of the speed traits. Haven't had to do that in a while. Of course, I guess I should mention that I haven't played in a while when I uh, make statements like that. Oh, you bit my torso jacket covery thing. I don't like it when they do that. It means that they're ripping my clothes. No zombie gets to rip my clothes, except for these zombies, and we're going to crack that soon enough. Okay, never mind. It looks like I'm managing. It's not quite as bad as it was seeming. They're just able to uh, catch up in the short, apparently. I think that's just a thing. They're not actually... Well, maybe they are faster, or it, or not faster, but... Even enough that it's weird, one way or another. They do keep hitting me, which is annoying. Uh, the zombies are all at relative low health, luckily, so... Hmm. 
Hmm. I'm gonna die. Yeah, I did it wrong there. Um. Yeah. Hmm. Did it wrong. When do I respawn? <laughs> did it wrong. When do I respawn? Oh, well. That was interesting. I think I can do it now. The only thing I'll probably change is switch it to summer because that's really the biggest problem I'm having. Well, besides the zombies, but the fact that I need to wear so much clothes right off the start. Actually, you know what? No, I'm not going to change it to summer because that is one of the new challenges. If you start in the spring, it's going to be cold. And just to put it in perspective, I had encumbrance on my legs and stuff, so I wasn't moving as fast. So either A, you could buy one of the speed things, which if we uh, take a quick look and I said take a quick look, game, do what I tell you to do. Oh, there we go. If we take a look in traits, it's like all of the uh, speed ones, like cost three. You want to be... Uh, Let's see, where's the other one? Uh, there's a couple, I think. Parkour. Cost two, but this one only... doesn't give you speed, it just makes you faster over terrain obstacles. Then here, quick. It's like, yeah. Three. Um, I can't remember. Uh, stats. Do any of these affect speed? Oh, that I can remember. But, overall, that basically just means that I could choose something that's two to three points more. If you actually want real speed and not just uh, uh, illusion of real speed, it's three points. Or I could wear less pants in the short run. That's probably really the biggest thing that always let me get away without getting any of the speed traits. I'll probably try the speed traits some um, next video. Anyway, this is Zachary Drown, and I'm signing off.